be with it running. What's up? Someone called the police. Someone called the police? Yeah. Police are downstairs. Uh, all right, hold on. What that? This, I'm live streaming right now. Hold on, I got swatted. Yeah, I got swatted. <laughs> uh, no. You drank all that shit? I did drink all of them. Oh, man. Jesus Christ. Sorry, man. The cops are really nice, though. It was all... It, I, I feel bad for them. I don't even really, really care. Well, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. I guess uh, the quartering will probably be making a video soon, uh, blaming me for this uh, because if you guys didn't know, I'm a uh, I'm a known doctor and swatter myself, and this is the kind of stuff that I do apparently. So, just want to say it right now before Jeremy tries to make a video telling people or puts a tweet out telling people uh, I had nothing to do with this, guys. Yeah, I'm not I'm not that dude that does this, and whoever are the people that do this, uh, you know what, man? Listen. Uh, it's dangerous, right? It's dangerous. You want to order some pizzas? You know, that's cool. You want to order some black female uh, escorts? Uh, you know, that's that's kind of funny in my books a little bit. It's, you know, it's it's borderline harassment and uh, it's borderline a bit out there. But you know, it's got some it's got some comedic value to it. But calling the cops can be dangerous, especially in America, because the police down there, some of them are definitely coming in a little too hot, should they say, and not because someone's black, okay, let's just keep real on that, some of those black people definitely deserve to get thrown to the ground and then handcuffed, you know, they're, they're acting like idiots trying to get a, a viral tweet going on, oh, I'm not resisting arrest, well, you sure, uh, sure, <laughs> when people yell and I'm not resisting arrest, they're usually the ones resisting arrest, but... Swatting somebody is what one would call probably not the best of ideas, if you know what I'm saying. Like it, it's it's dangerous. It's it's a major crime, and as we've seen in the past, the tragedy that Call of Duty Swatter, who I think got 20 years in jail, uh, it can lead to people getting killed. So, like, really, for a prank, bro, it's just just a prank, bro. It's just a prank, bro. I would have to say that uh, it's not just a prank, bro, when you're, when you're actually swatting somebody and calling the cops. That's just called, hey, if I found out who did that, I might be more inclined to take a baseball bat and jam it up your ass. Big ups to Rich for handling it so well. Uh, dude uh, came in and did it like handled like a stud and glad nothing bad happened. But the swatting is uh, a next level uh, bad move. Um, like I said, order some pizzas. Get a Black and Decker Pecker record order to the house. You know that 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 you know if, if you hate the person that much and you're trying to roll that way, you know what? That's the most egregious thing you could probably could do. But you know, call the uh, the punk po the, the the piggy wiggies the boys in blue. The uh, five zero, uh, yeah, like not not the best of ideas there, bro. Not not a big brain move. Wouldn't recommend it. Uh, kind of stupid. Puts a lot of people's lives at risk. Has potential to turn to into a uh, a very fatal and uh, sad situation over a prank. So yeah, uh, as uh, as your boy uh, Shabbat Shalom would say, cut it out. I'm not the quartering, so there's not really much more I can add to this to make it into a 10-minute video, but it's pretty simple. Uh, don't don't call the cops. Don't swat somebody. That's, that's some next level. Like, you know, basically you're threatening someone's life. You're having the potential of a very situa very serious situation occurring, and uh, that's, no matter how much you hate somebody who does YouTube videos, uh, that's that's a bit too much. bit too much. Uh, pizzas and Black and Decker Pecker Wreckers uh, is about as far as I'm willing to let someone take it if you hate someone that much, even though that's not that cool. But anyways, all right, Eight Thoughts is out. Thanks for watching the video. I'll see you on the next one. Uh, stay black and don't let the hockey crackers, reptilian shapeshifters, bring you down. Peace out.